I was uh, outside, but not really outside, because at our house uh, we have a, um, a patio, an outside patio that has a screen, like a porch, and then that leads over to the pool area. And I remember being out there, and the door was open, so from our patio to the pool area, and there was this cute little creature that was just right there hanging on the door. And the door was kind of swinging, and he was swinging with the door, but it looked like he was making his way into the porch. Now, I remember my mom does not like things inside the house. Anyone, your mom's the same way? Keep them out, right? So keep the door closed so they don't come in, because that's how they like to come in. So I had the brilliant idea. Didn't think too much about it, but I'm simply going to go very quietly and carefully so I don't scare him. And I'm going to grab that door, and if I do it slowly, he may believe it. So I'm going to do it really fast. Okay, so I do do that. So I go real, real carefully, and I grab the door just right, and I look at him, he looks at me, and I boom, and I close the door. But there was one problem whenever I closed the door. I heard something croak, the loudest I've ever heard it croak before this loud noise and then I look over and I kind of do this and I notice that its head is on one side <laughs> and its body's on the other side and all of a sudden uh, I see the head part just kind of expand and get really 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 big so I go oh no I just killed it did I really so then I left it there no just kidding and then I opened the door back up and the poor little guy hopped and never wanted to see me again what did I almost kill right there, class? Oh. It was. It was a cute little tree frog. Poor little innocent thing.